this is a guitar, Alan Rogan, my wonderful guitar guy, bought me. Oh, it's a thing. Yeah. It's a little, it's called a shorty. Mm. A little tiny 12 string. Again, with unbelievably short words, I'll have to put on my glasses, which are not, are not designer glasses. But this is a song I'll get you a pair of glasses. Please. I wrote in um, 1971. Oh my god, I don't know, darling. You need glasses to find your glasses. Oh, I do indeed, you're right. I'll, I'll go and get them in a minute. I'll go and get them in a minute. Can I have, can have, have you find Pete's glasses? No, no, no. They've got a fairy that does things out there. <laughs> they're, in my, they're in my little bag, I think. Outside. Anyway, so this is a song. It's a song I wrote in 1972. Okay. 1972. That was and the word bomb. lazy is in it. Ah, oh. sounds like a song. Is the me. word crazy in it? The word crazy. If I, the word lazy, is in it, there's probably a good <laughs> chance that the word crazy is. Hazy. In it. Oh, if the word crazy, then I'm going to be a bit depressed. Yeah. Hazy. Actually, then in that case, before then, then I do I, I do that. I might read my posh poem. Oh, good. No, 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 I'll do the song first, then the push. I'll take it over here, aren't I? Listen, you two, you go and amuse yourself. Shall we just let you go okay. on with it, sweetheart? Talking of posh poems, I'm going to get Jerry to come down and read Thank you. two or three of her poems on In the Antic. She will As do I it. Said, she will do it. I've will spoken she? to her about it, she'll do it. Well, that would be great because they're good. The fucking she's got such a great voice as well. Isn't yeah. It? Anyway. <laughs> but not in the way that I'm going to sing it. The Who did record it, but it never got very far. We recorded it at the end. We did the Who's Next album, which was a big smash. We won't get fooled again behind Blue Eyes, Barbara O'Reilly, all that stuff. And then we did another album after that, which had Relay, uh, joined together in the band, and a couple of other songs, which never... Marvin? Which never... No, Marvin was on Who's Next. Not which was never released. Because it wasn't, it was, it felt it didn't match up, to, it didn't measure up to who's next. And I went on to then to do Quadrophenia, which of which course did, did, did measure up. But, but this is one of the songs that we recorded that didn't even. even oh, that's my phone. Wait, answer it on air. Go on. Could be Sam and Dave. You can say, I'm on air. Quick. Sam and Dave. Sam and Dave. Sam and Hello? Hello? I've got no signal. Oh, oh. That would be there. really funny. I did just ask Sam Mendes to call me. Sam Mendes, the director. Bring him down here and get Kate over for a cup of coffee. My friend, well, they're in California. <laughs> they're, they're in Malibu. Ooh. Right. This is, yeah, it's in, it's in whatever this is. <laughs>
Change it to Bone Idol. Did you? Yeah. No, no, it's obviously. Does that mean I get a bit of the publishing? <laughs> kind of, in a roundabout way. You do manage to sort of weed in your way into quite a bit of my publishing anyway, darling. Yeah, I do, it's great. Um, so. Love it. It's all about the music today. I've got a new segment. And what's that? Well, it's going to be called Angels in the Attic. I was going to call it Rachel's Angels in kind of a Charlie's Angels way. And it reminded me of when I was at college,